Rifa R. al Tatawai was an Egyptian writer, teacher, translator, Egyptologist, and Renaissance intellectual. Tatawai was among the first Egyptian scholars to write about Western cultures in an attempt to bring about a reconciliation and an understanding between Islamic and Christian civilizations. He founded the School of Languages in 1835 and was influential in the development of science, law, literature and Egyptology in 19th century Egypt. His work influenced that of many later scholars including Muhammad Abdu. Background Tartawai was born in 1801 in the village of Tata, Sohag, the same year the French troops evacuated Egypt. He was an Azarite recommended by his teacher and mentor Hassan el Atta to be the chaplain of a group of students Muhammad Ali was sending to Paris. In 1826, many student missions from Egypt went to Europe in the early 19th century to study arts and sciences at European universities and acquire technical skills such as printing, shipbuilding and modern military techniques. According to his memoir Rilla Tatawai studied ethics, social and political philosophy, and mathematics and geometry. He read works by Condillac, Voltaire, Rousseau, Montesquieu and Bezout among others during his séjour in France. In 1831, Tatawai returned home to be part of the statewide effort to modernize the Egyptian infrastructure and education. He undertook a career in writing and translation, and founded the School of Languages in 1835. The School of Languages graduated the earliest modern Egyptian intellectual milieu, which formed the basis of the emerging grassroots mobilization against British colonialism in Egypt. Three of his published volumes were works of political and moral philosophy. They introduced his Egyptian audience to Enlightenment ideas such as secular authority and political rights and liberty, his ideas regarding how a modern civilized society ought to be and what constituted by extension a civilized or good Egyptian, and his ideas on public interest in public good. Tartawi's work was the first effort in what became an Egyptian renaissance that flourished in the years between 1860 to 1940. He died in Cairo in 1873. Muslim Modernity Tartawai is considered one of the early adapters to Islamic modernism. Islamic modernists attempted to integrate Islamic principles with European social theories. In 1826, al Tartawai was sent to Paris by Mehmet Ali. Tartawai studied at an educational mission for five years, returning in 1831. Tartawai was appointed director of the School of Languages. At the school, he worked translating European books into Arabic. Tartawai was instrumental in translating military manuals, geography, and European history. In total, al Tartawai supervised the translation of over 2,000 foreign works into Arabic. al Tartawai even made favorable comments about French society in some of his books. Tartawai stressed that the principles of Islam are compatible with those of European modernity. In his piece, The Extraction of Gold or an Overview of Paris, Tartawai discusses the patriotic responsibility of citizenship. Tartawai uses Roman civilization as an example for what could become of Islamic civilizations. At one point all Romans are united under one Caesar but split into East and West. After splitting, the two nations see, all its wars ended in defeat, and it retreated from a perfect existence to non-existence. Tartawai understands that if Egypt is unable to remain united, it could fall prey to outside invaders. Tartawai stresses the importance of citizens defending the patriotic duty of their country. One way to protect one's country according to Tartawai is to accept the changes that come with a modern society. Work A selection of his works are Tartawai's writings A Paris Profile, written during Tartawai's stay in France, The Methodology of Egyptians' Minds with Regard to the Marvels of Modern Literature, published in 1869 crystallizing Tartawai's opinions on modernization. 
The Honest Guide for Re-Education of Girls and Boys, published in 1873 and reflecting the main precepts of Tartawi's educational thoughts. Taufik al-Ghalil Insights into Egypt's and Ishmael Descendants' History the first part of the History Encyclopedia published in 1868 and tracing the history of ancient Egypt till the dawn of Islam, a thorough summary of the biography of Muhammad published after Tartawi's death, towards a simpler Arabic grammar published in 1869. Grammatical Sentences, published in 1863, Egyptian Patriotic Lyrics, written in praise of Khedive Said and published in 1855, The Luminous Stars in the Moonlit Nights of Al-Aziz, a collection of congratulatory writings to some princes, published in 1872, Tartawi's Translations The History of Ancient Egyptians, published in 1838, the Arabization of Trade Law, published in 1868. The Arabization of the French Civil Law, published in 1866. The Unequivocal Arabization Approach to Geography, published in 1835. Small Scale Geography, published in 1830. Metals and Their Use, published in 1867. Ancient Philosophers, published in 1836. Principles of Engineering, published in 1854, Useful Metals, published in 1832, Logic, published in 1838, Sages Engineering, published in 1874, General Geography, The French Constitution, On Health Policies, On Greek Mythology, 